On now to road conditions. They continue to get worse minute by minute. We're going to get an update now from Ted Talbot with the Maine Department of Transportation. Good morning, Ted. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. I know that you are awfully busy. Uh, we did mention at the top of the show that state offices are closed today, which means fewer people uh, potentially on the roads. Do you think people are heeding the warnings from officials to stay at home if they can? Good morning. Yes, they certainly are. It's really allowing our plow crews to try to keep up with exactly what they have to keep up with. Uh, as you know, of course, it started in the southern region early this morning. We deployed our southern region crews around midnight, uh, around 445 this morning. Uh, the mid-coast, our crews have started to get out and, and started to fight this, uh, this storm. The visibility, as you know, is near zero, anywhere from Kittery all the way through to Topsom. Um, and with no drivers on the road, again, it's really helping our crews do what they have to do. York County has about eight inches on the ground right now, but, of course, we have the blowing and the drifting of the snow. That's going to happen through all regions of the state today. So what we're really, you know, short of a travel ban, we're really just uh, uh, beckoning folks not to be on the road today with the low visibility and the conditions that will only worsen as a day continues. And Ted, a, a reminder, Ted, for folks, if they happen to have to go out, what should they um, bring with them in their car to be safe? Well, listen, you should always have a flashlight. You should always have a blanket. You should always have water. You should have the essentials. You need to think ahead if you're in a snowbank, if you're in a delay, that uh, if, if there's a slide off and the state police have to close that section of road, what would you need to be in that car for a lengthy period of time? Those are some of the items that you should always have. Make sure your cell phone is charged. Make sure you have your charger uh, for the cell phone. These are essentials that, that should happen. And it could happen. You know, there, there is essential travel that's going to be happening on the highways. And uh, we just want everyone to be as safe as possible. Please allow the plows to do everything that they can, allow them enough room. Remember, the road condition behind the plow is much better than in front of the plow. All right, Ted Talbot from the Maine Department of Transportation, thank you so much for those important reminders. Again, you just can't hear it too much. I mean